So some of the hardest decisions you have to make are, is, is deciding which varieties of vegetables, specifically tomatoes, that you want to grow. You've only got so much space and there's basically an unlimited variety of tomatoes. So every year what I try to do is do a taste test, decide which ones I like the best, or really decide which ones I don't want to grow anymore. This year I have about eight different varieties of tomatoes, but I've only got five here because these are what's ripe right now. Uh, so we have Cherokee Purple, Lemon Boy, Blue Beauty, I think this one's called Black Prince, uh, but I'm not positive, and then a Roma. We're just going to slice them up and see which ones you like best. Cherokee Purple's been producing pretty well. It's got a nice Boy, look at how meaty it is. It really, there's not a lot of seeds in it. It's a lot of meat, which is good. We got Lemon Boy. Pretty good meatiness, not too many seeds. Blue Beauty. Probably has more seeds than the other two varieties. Black Prince. Very seedy. Yeah, not look liking the looks of that one. And then Roma. Kind of sliced that one on an angle. Not too bad. I think this is more like a, uh, a pasta or tomato sauce tomato. So wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't my favorite eating it raw. Looks like got a little bad spot in there. All right, let's try the uh, Cherokee purple. pretty sweet. I'm not a real, I'm not a big tomato connoisseur, but I don't think that has much acid in it. I would guess very sweet, very meaty, almost like a really creamy melon. Pretty good. Lemon Boy. A lot more tang to it, hence the name. Yeah, I just brought this for looks. A little tangy, probably more acid. Definitely not sweet, like the Cherokee Purple. All right, Blue Beauty. Let's see if it's beautiful. <clears throat> not tangy like the Lemon Boy, but not really sweet like the Cherokee Purple. Just kind of middle of the road. Yeah. Black Prince. I don't know if I've eaten Black Prince or Blue Beauty. They they taste the same. Yeah, kind of watery. Nothing special there. And Roma. Death. <clears throat> Definitely tastes like a spaghetti sauce tomato. Not not one that I would enjoy eating raw or on a sandwich. Cherokee Purple, hands down, my favorite by far. Not even close. Mmm. That's that's a good tomato. I don't really enjoy eating tomatoes raw very often. But I can definitely eat the Cherokee Purple raw and enjoy it. So, I brought my pregnant wife in because her taste buds are always on point. <clears throat> so, let's see what you She just should have left that one for last. <laughs> that one's really good. So I like this one. It's not as sweet. I don't think it's, you said it was sour? Tangy. Tangy. I don't think it's tangy. But I also like eating tomatoes by themselves, so. That's the Blue Beauty, which to me tastes like water. Yeah, that one's not as good. There's no, there's no flavor in that. It's kind of. Try that one now, see if you can tell the difference. It's like a watered down sauce. Yeah. 
Black Prince, Blue Beauty. There's nothing special about those. I do think this one's a little better. I think this one's a little bit sweeter. Black Prince over this one. <clears throat> Could be. Now try that. The, the Roma. <laughs> it's definitely a sauce tomato. The, tex I, the texture's I don't like all wrong. That one. <laughs> yeah, the texture's texture's all bad. It's it's almost crunchy and mushy at the same time. I don't I don't really know. Hands down, Cherokee purple. Yep. Lemon boy. Either one of those doesn't matter. I would say and I would this pick one. this one third. But these these two are definitely Yeah. Yeah. So there you go. Maybe try the Lemon Boy again next year. Definitely uh, doing more Cherokee Purple. Hmm. All right, now we're going to see if we're totally making this up <laughs> by doing blind taste tests. So, you close, and I will not trick you and put a bug in your hand or anything. Uh, close your eyes, and I'll slice one. Like you did the last. Yeah, I didn't, you know. gave me I didn't do that. Yesterday. Close your eyes, I'm going to put a piece in your hand, and you tell me which tomato you think it is. Got a guess? You know what it's not? Maybe narrow it down that way? You can open your eyes now. Is that Cherokee Purple? <laughs> <laughs> I just knew it had yeah. to be Cherokee Purple. No, it purple. is not. All right, let's try again. Close okay, your eyes. Okay, it's got to be one of those then. Close your eyes. Okay. Mm. That's going to taste good. <laughs> try and trick me. Uh, you can open them. <clears throat> Lemon boy. Nope. Oh. <laughs> All right. It's this one. Cl yeah, that is correct. Okay. All right, close your eyes. <laughs> Maybe I should have given her a little bigger piece so you could actually. Oh, this is Cherokee purple. Hey, got Definitely. it. Definitely. That one's good. Um, that was Cherokee purple. All right, close your eyes. Last one. Of course, you've already narrowed two of them down. Lemon Boy. Nope. That was Blue Beauty. Oh. So, mm. he definitely got the best tasting one, which is really the only one that matters. Well, it stands apart more than the other ones. All right. My turn. All right, now let's see if I can tell the difference. Uh, all right, close my eyes. Cherokee purple. <laughs> <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> it's not that one. No, I, after I said that, I, I knew it was not. Um, it's definitely one of those two. It's probably this one. Yes. <clears throat> All right, next one. It was really creamy. That's why I said that. And then the taste hit me. And it was too too tart and it's acidic. <laughs> that was aroma. It was Lemon Boy. Yes, it was Lemon yeah, Boy. Yeah, turns out I don't like that one. Well, it was a lot of uh, skin. Mm. Sorry. Boy, I'm really bad at this. <laughs> I don't like the skin. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> Just give me the Cherokee Purple. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> that tastes good. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> really seedy. It's probably a lemon boy again. No. Was it that one? Yes. Mm. I could definitely tell there was a lot of seeds in it. Of course that could just be the piece it was. All right. <laughs> hmm. 
Hmm. A lot of seeds. I have no idea. Alright. Mm. <laughs> now this aroma? Yes. Well, I got the, that one right. The texture is really weird. All right. It wasn't bad. But I still think it was one of those. No. This one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. Turns out it doesn't matter what tomato. <laughs> as long as I eat it with my eyes closed, it'll be. So it turns out I really don't have that refined of a, of a taste bud. <laughs> I think I was focusing more on texture than I was flavor. Because when you close your eyes and do that, it changes everything you perceive about the food. And the seeds was probably my least favorite part. I don't like I don't like a lot of seeds. And one of those slices that had a lot of skin in it and not a lot of meat. And that might be why I really like the Cherokee purple. And the pieces I ate with my eyes open is because there was a lot of just like solid melony flesh um, with very little seeds in it. So, gonna have to go uh, practice my tomato taste testing. <laughs>